Hi guys, welcome to another edition of the Anoki Uncensored Show. This week, I'll be rolling in the deep with Bollywood superstar Amir Khan, where we chat about his latest film, Lal Singh Jada. The film is the Indian adaptation of the American classic, Forrest Gump, where Khan plays the title role. The film also stars Kareena Kapoor. I asked him why he chose to take on this role, how the script was adapted from a film rooted in American culture to then speak to South Asian sensibilities and what he hopes people will get out of watching this version of the classic. Here's what he had to say. The maestro himself. <laughs> Welcome to the world of Anoki, Amir. Such a Hi. pleasure to be chatting with you. Hi, Raj. How are you? I am wonderful. So I want to just jump right in. Forrest mm -hmm. Gump is a story rooted in American culture. Mm -hmm. How was this translated over to speak to South Asian sensibilities? I want to start mm -hmm. there. Well, you know, I would. I, I had the same thought because Atul, who's a friend, uh, co-actor and friend, he wrote. Uh, so one day Atul and I were sitting and chatting and we were talking about films that we loved. And I mentioned Forrest Gump. And two weeks later, he calls me up and says, I've written an Indian adaptation of Forrest Gump. Now, this statement sh shocked me on three counts. One, Atul has never written the script before. Two, he's <laughs> written an adaptation of Hold Your Breath, Forrest Gump. <laughs> Which is a cult classic. And as you said, you rooted in America, in American culture. And he's done it in two weeks. <laughs> so I was like, uh, it didn't sound very encouraging. And I said, yes, yes, I'm so happy you've done that. But I was also busy at that time and it took me a while and I wasn't really taking it so seriously. And it took me two years before I finally sat down and heard what he had written. And uh, that was the day everything changed for me. When I heard the Tell script, me why. Just, yeah, what was it about this? Because we know that you're very specific about the roles you take on because it's an investment of time and mm. you really, really go deep. You, 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 you really kind of dissect things and... I know that you always have kind of an overarching purpose for every film you take on. What was it about this script that really encapsulated you? Yeah, I, I, I'll tell you. So when I heard the script, the adaptation that Atul wrote, I just fell in love with it. I was so moved. I was so fascinated. And it kind of made me revisit the classic Forrest Gump because I'd right. seen it like maybe 15, 20 years ago. You know, it had been a long time since I'd seen it. And while it reminded me and it brought me all the joy of Forrest Gump, but somehow it had made it closer to me as an Indian. It Somehow because Atul's adaptation of bringing it into Indian culture and the Sar Sardarji character, the Sikh character, you know, all of that, the mother's character, it kind of, it almost felt Indian. <laughs> yes. You know, if, if, if you were to have not seen Forrest Gump, you would be like, how would you adapt this into an American film? You know, right. he asked the question the other way around. So, 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 but, but to answer the question in more detail, the one thing that really, that I loved about it was the innocence of the character of Lal mm -hmm. and the strength that innocence has without doing anything. On, on the large screen, we're used to watching our protagonists and heroes having physical strength, moral strength. But here is a hero who has innocence as his strength. Right. And, and it's almost as if the universe conspires to do things for you if you are pure and innocent. Absolutely. And and and, and it, it shows out, it it it's it plays out in the form of some miraculous things happening in his life. You know? So miracles do happen. It, it's a film that kind of makes you believe in miracles once again. Mm -hmm. and, and that's that's what really pulled me to this material. Absolutely. And, you know, it's interesting because you just mentioned that Lal Singh Chada is a Sikh Sardar. I'm curious to know what characteristics in that particular Indian subset culture were mm -hmm. felt to be the most authentic translation of the character. I think mm -hmm. you kind of alluded to some of it, his simplicity and a number of other things. Yes, but I feel yes. that it was on purpose that, you know, you guys chose a Sikh Sardar for this translation so to be authentic. Well, I think it was Atul's choice because when I heard the script, it was uh, written as a Sikh character. Okay. And I felt that that's, that's, it felt so right to me. I mean, I, I didn't even question that because that's how I felt. You know, when he, when he read it out to me, I was, yes, this is how it should be. Technically, yes, it could be a South Indian character. It could be a Bengali character. It could be placed anywhere in India, of course. Mm -hmm. But somehow this felt right when I heard the script. And, right. and 
uh, I've never asked Atul really why he chose to keep it a Sikh character, but I think it's because perhaps because of the socio political events that happened in the 80s right. and if the character is a sikh character it gets rooted emotionally really deep uh, deeply you know and it 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 pulls the audience in in a very deep way uh, absolutely that, that's maybe why that's maybe why he made it a sikh character absolutely that sounds just about right and when you think mm-hmm. of the sikh culture you think of simplicity and and transparency and all these things that really do and, lend and, to the and, character and, and, and generosity. Yes. It's a very generous of spirit. Absolutely. You know? uh, Amir, one final question for you. What do you hope people get out of watching Lal Singh Chadha? <laughs> well, the one thing I'm hoping is that all of us once again start believing in innocence. Amen to that. <laughs> Thank you so much, Amir. Thank what you. an absolute pleasure. You truly are, um, you know, our version of you know, probably the most enigmatic, the most charismatic, the most humble actor that is a character actor. And and we're we're truly excited about the entire audience out there, the world out there, getting your adaptation of Forrest Gump. Thank you for your time. It was so lovely talking to you, Raj. Thank you. Thank you. Likewise. हो रहा है जो हो रहा है क्यों तुम न जानो ना हम पंपरम क्या पता हम में है कहानिया है कहानी में हम पंपरम कभी कभी जो ये आधी लगती है आधी लिख दे तू आधी रह जाने दे जाने दे जिंदगी है जैसे बारिशों का पानी आधी भर ले तू आधी बह जाने दे जाने दे हम समंदर का एक खतरा है या समंदर है हम पंपरम हथेली की लकीरों में लिखी सारी है या जिंदगी ये तेरे इरादों की मारी है है तेरी मेरी समझदारी समझ पाने में या इसको ना समझ ना ही समझदारी है बैठी कलियों पे तितली के जैसी कभी रुकने दे कभी उड़ जाने दे जाने दे जिंदगी है जैसे बारिशों का पानी आधी भर ले तू आधी बह जाने दे जाने दे है जरूरत से थोड़ी ज्यादा या है जरूरत से कम पम पर क्या पता हम में है कहानी या है कहानी हम पंपरम
Grab your tickets to Lal Singh Chadha, hitting theatres nationwide on August the 11th. This is one for the family guys. See you at the theatre this Thursday.